Hello, well, thank you. Hello, Woking, and it's it's great to. Um, this is Devon calling. Um, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to set my timer for five minutes. Try and cram in as many short poems as possible. Here we go. This is called Poem. I am the tightrope walker. The rope I walk is tight. I am the tightrope walker, performing every night. One step, then another. Slowly, slowly, slow. I might pretend to wobble. It's all part of the show. I am the tightrope walker. I do just what I feel. I often eat my lunch up there. It's such a balanced meal. I am the tightrope walker. I really do have skill. I am the tightrope walker and not a telephone bill. Though we both have an outstanding balance. Okay, this is called Poem. There once was a man from Arbroath who couldn't decide, so had both. One of each thing, it made his heart sing to have those two things which I haven't specified, not that it matters, I'm crap at limericks. Okay, so this poem is just called Poem. I wish I was a papanda bear, I wish, I wish I was a pretty perky papanda bear, oh how I wish I was. Eating all the bamboo, washing my hair with shampoo. I wish I was a papanda bear, but I'm not, I'm not, I'm not. I wish I was a papanda bear, my voice would be monotone. I wish I was a papanda bear, I'd call people on the phone. But I am not a papanda bear, nor am I monochrome. I couldn't think how to end this poem, so I just went with, Look out, here comes a meteor, we're all going to die. <laughs> Okay, so this um, next one is, oh, this is called Poem. If there's a bell, ring it. If there's a song, sing it. If there's no plan, wing it. If there's a boomerang, fling it. If it comes back, fling it. If it comes back, fling it. If there's a packed lunch, bring it. If there's a new book, begin it. If it's rubbish, bin it. This poem's quite good, in it. <laughs> okay, so what have we got? This is called Poem. Spontaneous human combustion on the train can be dangerous for the safety of other passengers. Please take care as you alight. <laughs> okay, this is called Poem. I bought a pencil in the Ennui gift shop. It was pointless. <laughs> poem. I put on an air show. People complained because they couldn't see anything. A lack do some settle in Somerset. Sunset set, sat unset, stomach upset, Somerset. Somersaulting, vaulting, some of greater parts. Haunting, dauntless, taunton, summer parks. I'd settle soon in Somerset, besotted thus with summer sex. Haystack fumbles, aching, wet, hanging round at nights with the badger set. Think of all the joy I'd get in Somerset. Although I do suspect, a sudden thought remains unsaid. I don't like barns or farms or country vets. And that is why I'll settle not in Somerset. Yeah. Uh, 56 seconds to go. Poem. I'm with Nonchalant Jim on the way to Torquay, on the number 12 bus, on the number 12 bus. Well, he couldn't decide exactly where he would sit, on the number 12 bus, on the number 12 bus. Up, down, perhaps at the back, right at the front or the foot of the stairs. He sat on the bus driver's lap. Now we're stuck in the ditch on the way to Torquay. Thank you very much. <laughs> and one last one quickly. Poem. 
I can't hear a thing in here. It really is quite noisy. How am I supposed to write? What with it being so noisy? The banging and the clatter, the grinding and the punching. I can't hear a bloody thing or concentrate for that matter. I wrote that poem in a workshop. <laughs> well, thank you very much. Thank you, Woking. Thank you, Gary. Thank you, Robert. Uh, so thanks to everyone for reading in the first half.